Today I'd like to share with you one of my favorite exercises for helping with flexibility and dexterity in your left hand. Grab your guitar and see if this exercise works for you. For this exercise, the first thing we need to do is place our pointer finger on the fifth fret of the D string. Our middle finger will go on the sixth fret, our ring finger on the seventh, and our pinky on the eighth. Now we're going to do movements with two fingers at a time and the other fingers are going to stay on that D string. So for the first stretch we're going to place our pointer finger now on the A string and our middle finger on the G string. And then we're going to flip. We're going to go middle finger on the A string and pointer finger on the G string. And we're going to do that movement five times. Four. Five. All the while, our ring finger and her pinky just stayed planted on that D string. The next combination is going to be our pointer finger and our ring finger. Three, four, and five. Okay, next we are going to do our pointer and our pinky. And just remember the goal here is not speed. We are just trying to stretch our fingers out. So do not worry about how fast you're going. It might be a little bit of a struggle at first just to get used to moving the fingers around independently. So pointer and pinky. I think this is three, four, five. Okay, next we have our middle and ring finger. Five. Okay, and finally we have our ring finger and our pinky. Now don't worry, this one can take a little bit of practice. Don't expect to be able to move easily right away. And that's it. Now, if this feels really good and you're not having any trouble with it at all, you can start by spreading your fingers a little bit further. So instead of going between the A string and the G string, you could move your pointer finger down to the E string. So we got a little bit more of a spread a little bit more of a stretch. And then if you get through that, that's great. You can start spreading a little further. Maybe we go E string to B string. Now, I'm pretty sure if you've never done this before, it's probably gonna be a challenge once you start trying to get that stretch with, say, your pinky and that ring finger. 
And you can start to see that as you progress, it's really going to help you grab some more difficult chords in the future. Start by giving yourself just five minutes with the exercise before each time you play. And see if you notice any difference in how you're playing or how your hand feels in general after about a month. If your hand feels really tight and not very flexible, even with just going between the A string and the G string, there's no need to progress to spreading your fingers even further to the other strings. The last thing we want to do is overstretch our hands too soon and cause ourselves some kind of injury. So if you feel pain, stop. Give me a thumbs up if you find the exercise useful to you. Thank you so much for watching. Till next time.